Melody Where we bring you the best In Orange County Entertainment And that's right We are back Victor is back on the air February 1st Honeyman Street Television Back on Time Warner Cable I am back With a new heavyweight belt That's right I'm the public access heavyweight champion I won it over in Japan And beat all the Jap For that And I am back Mr. Dickie With a new look as you can see Dickie How about you? What about you? Uh, Victor has a new belt, and what about you? Order like every night? That's what you've been doing, Mr. Dickie. Why don't you step in the ring right now with El Victor? Come on down and step in the ring with El Victor. I'm feeling really, very, very, very good tonight. I tell you what, I feel so good tonight. I dare anyone, anyone out there, step in the ring with El Victor right now. told you not to call me here. Oh. Hello. Oh, yes, another one. And, you know, here we are at Pamela Anderson Countdown to Suicide. We've got, thank you very much for your call. Another one for Gunshot. What? Uh, Mr. Dickie! Dickie. Get down from there. Oh, sorry. We've got our own Pamela Anderson from Tool Time, kind of. we got Mr. Dickie here. And that's another one tally it up for Gunshot. It seems to be a favorite tonight, you know. I think people just don't have very much creativity. Gunshot, everyone does it. it to me, it's a typical cop-out. Well, I don't know. I think Pam Anderson is, uh, so far, she is, um... Oh! Phone's ringing off the hook. Pill seems to be the number one. Countdown to suicide. Oh, okay. Razor. 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 Pamela Anderson. Call Countdown to suicide. Michael from uh, Riverside there. Michael from, from Riverside. Riverside. Thanks, Mike. Razor, see now, I understand that you yourself, Greg, you say there's going to be a Tommy Lee murder. Yeah, I'm... I'm oh! Gonna, this is incredible. This person has to say. Hello. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking myself that it's going to be a, a, pills a again. murder. Another one for pills. I'm, I'm going all the way for murder, uh, suicide, you know, the double murder suicide. That's always... I, I think Tommy Lee is a little bit distraught. I saw him on that He's interview. Lost. Terrible, terrible. Yeah. She's dead. Phones oh. are going off the hook here. Mr. Uh, let's... Why don't you stand yep. up on the, uh... Thing? Oh. Another one for pills. Another one thanks, for pills. Thanks, caller. Dickie, take care of the uh, tally chart. We'll see you in about 15 minutes. We're back here with Pamela Anderson. Countdown to suicide.
I need a beer. You need a beer? Mm. Dickie, we need beer. Dickie, beers. Pamela Anderson, countdown to suicide. Here we are, and uh, as you saw the tally votes, call in at 714-960-1993. There's the phone right now. Caller. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, who are we speaking with, caller? This is Jim. Jim, how you doing? Jim, where are you from? Stanton. Stanton. How's things in Stanton? Well, you know, hey, I don't think I tried how you all are uh, just about Miss Anderson. What are you, some kind of obsessed fan? Were you some kind of obsessed fan? What did you just say? Call me Jewish. All right, let's go back to the uh, phone. Crank calls, you know. We're 714 talking about something. 1993 Call us and tell us how you think Pamela Anderson's going to off herself. Countdown to suicide. Pamela Anderson on the There's the phone right now. Call yeah, put me down for gunshot wound. I think she's going to kill herself with a gun. Gunshot, gunshot wound. wound. I'm more for the gunshot wound. Where, where do you think? Gunshot wound to the head, to the heart? Um, I was thinking more to the crotch. What kind of a gun? Uh, who is this? Countdown to suicide. Uh, Pamela Anderson, 714-960-1993. You know, you started getting a, a Texas accent there. Obviously. Countdown to suicide. <laughs> Caller. Caller. Hey, I was... Uh, you again. pizza? Uh, no, sorry. Wrong number, man. <laughs> Hi, I'm Raquel Darien, and I'm on Huntington Street. Hello, and welcome to Spanky's. Hello, ladies. understand what the anguish I'm going through. I mean, every day I tell you how much I love you. My love for you is beyond words. The feeling I get when you sit on my tongue, drip down my throat. You can't be replaced. Oh, please. Don't cry. Wipe your tears, young one. I'll always be with you. You always have a special place in my heart. <gasps> we can do this, you and I. Let's make it happen. Oh, shh. Shh. Don't say that. I'll always be here for you. I love you. Hey, how you doing? I'm doing all right, just, you know, doing a little reading. No, I'm fine, I'm fine. How are you? Yeah? You like that, don't you? Yeah. I don't know, I felt a little, you know, I'm glad we had a talk last night, but, you know, you seemed a little down. No, no, no one's here. No, I'm by myself. I ah, forget about all that. You know, I told you I love you. Mm-hmm, right. Sure, I can do that. So what label you got on tonight? Yeah? Are you wet? 
thought so. Mm. You're such a whore. <laughs> don't, don't stop. Don't talk to me. Honey! Mom! Woo! Cold out there. Turkey's done. What have you been up to all night? Dear God! No! what we're going to do now is we're going to review some of the tape just to show you at home what we're talking about. It's obvious that this woman is troubled. We all know what she's gone through recently. She's got that little kid. She's getting smacked around. Not like she doesn't deserve that, but we can't say that on TV, can we? Sure we can. She deserved okay. it. We just did. Yeah. But anyway, we're going to watch some of the tape. The tape. Listen to that porno music. I was four years old and I was in the library and there was probably a hundred kids around listening to story time, you know, with their hands up by their face. And the cameraman spotted me out and took a picture of me and they copyrighted it and put it in all the public libraries in British Columbia. That was my first modeling job. 